me feeling like I'm academics. Can't ride no way. Lack of information. Okay. All good. All right. Oh. Looked like from that same broadcast, Ray J called in, and Ray J uh, said that he almost got jumped by Diddy's sons. Huh. I wonder how this went. Here we go. Another thing. I watched the Chris Brown set. Y'all watch that? Nah, I ain't seen this yet. I ain't seen this yet. Yo, listen. Yes, bro, I watched it three times. Okay? This is what I don't like about it. It's a two-hour segment. At least 45 minutes of it is positive stuff. You know, they're using Chris Brown stuff. His interviews, how he came up as a kid and all this. And then you had these chicks uh, that come in and say, he, Chris Brown raped me, Chris Brown assaulted me, and they tell all these stories, then they flash in these signs, seven out of ten women this, or every ten years this, or women battered women this. But after they tell all the stories, each woman, each female, at the end of it, with no voice, the letters go up and says, after thorough investigation, nothing was there, no charges was brought. So if you get up and go to the bathroom in the middle of watching it and come back and miss that, you're going to see Chris Brown did that. Chris Brown do it. Okay, okay. Where's the part that, um, oh, hold on. Never mind. I skipped past it. Sorry. Ray J. Ray J. No. Listen. Listen. Now, everybody been calling me, and you know until you call me, I feel like it's no big deal. All right? So I'm talking to the exposure homies. They talking about the Combs is trying to rush you. And I'm like, what are you talking about? Uh, they tried to rush you in Miami? Nigga, in LA, nigga. Where? Bro, you know I'm not going to call y'all because this could go somewhere else. And I'm like, you know, at the club, dog. Well, don't, you didn't have Donut then with you? I had nobody with really, me. So how many of them was it? Two, three? What? I don't know, like eight. Oh, so it was them and eight. And that nigga, yo, them Combs brothers told y'all to stop saying no Diddy. Yeah. Yeah, I, I thought that no Diddy shit was going to fly. Now it's over for that now. Christian Combs in the club with you talking about, he going he gonna, to he, he gonna haul him, shake his way to slap the shit out of you for saying no Diddy. Get out of here, nigga. Now, I know where this is coming from. This is coming from, from Ray J., Diddy, he he'd been doing some interviews, uh, and they've been asking him about um, Diddy. Hold on, hold on, where's the interviews at? Yeah. Let's get into the Diddy situation, okay? Everybody's flipping out. Nobody knows what to do. Nobody's saying nothing. I know I did the first interview on News Nation, and now I see a whole lot of interviews coming after. Are you guys waiting for somebody to like be the front runner? to speak out and to say what they feel because I'm not scared. Are there? <laughs> you not scared? <laughs> not when Christian Combs roll up on you. You know, I'm not going to call y'all because this could go somewhere else. And I'm like, you know, at the club, dog. Well, don't, you didn't have donut then with you? I had nobody with really, me. So how many of them was it? Two, three, what? I don't know, like eight. Oh, so it was them and eight, and they tried to rush you for real. Yeah, but don't put this up, blood. Nah, it's going out. Nah, blood. It's going, it's just going out, dog. Like, fuck them niggas down. So my question to you is, can I put the other stuff out that we've been knowing about? Nah, they they, they too young. Like, it's like that. Like, I, I moved away from it. Like, Huh? I tried to talk some sense into like what happened, but I just, you know what I'm saying? Luckily, the homie Chris is here. What? Wait, what Chris? Chris Brown, bro. Wait, well, whack. Don't put this shit up online. Bro. Nah, what's this? Oh, fuck. <laughs> Don't put this online. It's already online. <laughs> whack. You learning, bro. <laughs> Them niggas. Nah, but still. Don't it's going up. It's already online. It's online that the niggas tried to rush you and you ain't told me shit. It's everywhere, nigga. It's everywhere that the 
Niggas tried to rush you. They ain't say they put their hands on you. I just said the little homie gonna squabble up. I thought it was just one. Now you telling me them and eight niggas, so it's on. Yeah, but it don't need to be like that. Nah, that's what it's gonna be. That's what it's gonna be. All right, so I'm gonna call you when I get back tomorrow. I'm gonna pull up on you. All right. They tried to get the little homie. Yeah, but whack, they hot as they hot as fire grease right now. Leave those niggas alone. Man, they, man, I don't give a fuck how hot they is. They, they, they hot. Damn. I ain't gonna lie to y'all, man. Chris Brown, nah, that nigga better than me. This is a time. Hey, listen, them niggas fighting mad lawsuits. It's time to sue. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> I'm suing. God damn it. Diddy's sons. Forming like Voltron to whip niggas' asses. Holy shit. They hot. Nigga, we run into you, high. nigga. We, we run into you. Act like it's 1995. Yeah. Period. They hot, though. Damn. Christian Combs like that? I had nobody really. Done. So, how many of them was it? Two, three? What? No, like eight. Oh, so it was them and eight, and they tried to rush you for real. Yeah, but don't put this up, blood. Nah, it's going out. Nah, blood. It's going, it's just going out, dog. Like, <laughs> fuck them niggas down. So my question to you is, can I put the other stuff out that we've been knowing about? Nah, they, they, they too young. Like, like that. Like, I, I moved away from like. Huh? I tried to talk some sense into like what happened, but I just, you know what I'm saying, luckily the homie Chris is here. What? Wait, what Chris? Chris Brown, bro. Wait, well, whack. Don't put this shit up online. Bro. Nah, what's this? I don't fuck them niggas. Nah, but still, don't. It's going up. It's already online. It's online that the niggas tried to rush you and you ain't told me shit. Okay, fuck here's the. Uh... Here's a TMZ article. I guess TMZ, I guess it was up. So TMZ ran this article. Diddy's sons attempted to fight Ray J. Diddy's sons were ready to get in an all-out fist fight with Ray J at a recent Halloween party, but put their plans on pause because of an unexpected hero. Sources tell TMZ to rap three moguls, sons, Christian, Quincy, and Justin got into a heated face-off with Ray J outside of influencer Tara Electric unruly agency Halloween bash in Los Angeles over the weekend. And we're told that when the party wrapped up, Ray J made his way to the parking lot with his crew, Amber Rose and manager, but was confronted by Diddy's three sons. Nigga, I imagine, I imagine, I imagine they confronted, they confronted that nigga like it was the three Migos, nigga. The three Migos confront Joe Budden. Migos versus <laughs> Nigga, I imagine, I, I imagine. <laughs> I imagine they stood up like this. Yo, which one, yo, which one is Quavo? Which one, which one out of Diddy's sons is Quavo? You gotta be Christian, right? <laughs> which one's Quavo? Imagine they, look. <laughs> Bush. Bush. I mean, that's one thing I like. <laughs> look, they pulled up on some shit like this. Have a good show. That's Christian. That's Quincy. And that's Justin. What's up? What's up? What's up? Roll up the cufflinks. What's up? What's up? What's up? <laughs> Damn. Amber Rose and manager David Wontraub. Why does that name sound familiar? Who's David Wontraub? Let me Google that name. David Wontraub. Who's the manager of? That name sound familiar, manager of, who is he? Well, maybe he's manager of nobody. He don't got, he don't got the name in the thing. You, usually you would see the artist name in the thing. Okay, anyway. Sources say siblings surrounded the singer. Oh, shit. As they were upset about some public comments Ray J made about Bad Boy Records. We're told things got heated within the group with each other getting each other's faces, chest bumping. Uh -huh. Bump, bump, bump. Okay. Uh, sources claim both Justin and Christian made it clear. Let's fight. Oh, shit. These things want to squabble. Told you about say no diddy, nigga. 
Yo, I didn't even think Christian was like that. Now they wanted to squab. Oh, shit. Incident didn't escalate further. However, Chris Brown, who witnessed everything going on from his car, rushed out. Yo, I don't know why I think this is some, some Power Ranger shit. Chris Brown pulls his shit down. He wearing glasses. He looks down. He sees that Ray J about to get jumped. Hops out the car and does five consecutive backflips till he gets there. Looking like speed. I show speed, nigga. Comes in and be like, stop. Stay there, Ray J. Christian, Justin Quincy. Hold on. I want to take you down. I, I don't know what the fuck is going on. A bunch of R. Yo, what the fuck? Chris Brown. Yo. Chris, Ray J. Chris Brown. Christian Combs. And Justin. Oh, now nah, this is great. Now nah, this is great. Now nah, this is a great. Now we got. Now we know our, Chris Brown's an R&B singer. But Chris Brown's a tough gangster. He's like a. He's a real nigga. We all know that. But I just imagine. That nigga just coming in like. Gyrating and shit. Hold up. You know what I mean? <laughs> you know what I mean? All that shit he been doing on stage. You ever see one of Chris Brown's concert? They got this nigga on a Wheel of Fortune shit. He just spinning, nigga, and grinding his waist. And all the girls are like, oh, my God, I'm wet. It's just crazy. So I imagine Chris Brown hit five consecutive backflips coming this bitch. You know what I mean? Just stop it. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know, bro. I don't know. Go ahead, though. It wasn't the first time they confronted Ray J. Damn. They told the kids approach him several times prior. We're told Christian, Quincy, and Justin try to fight Ray J on three different occasions. Yo, Ray J, you got to catch his fade, bro. <laughs> Yo, if, if you these three niggas, are you doing a 1v1 versus Ray J? Or are you just going to like... <laughs> Yo, you got to fight all three of us at the same time. Nah, shout out to these, these niggas riding the hall for their daddy, though. Sources say Ray J considers Diddy and his ch children family to refuse to get... So he refused to let him get stuff get punked by a little kid. <laughs> nah, this is too funny. <laughs> Yo, nah, this is too funny. Nah, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Yo, yo, I seen Amber Rose post some shit. Looked like she was there, Amber Rose. Nah, this is comedy. This is jokes. Check this out. Look at this, chat. <laughs> this was Ray J last night. Oh, man. Remember Ray J been trying to catch a fade with Lemmy? <laughs> he ain't want to catch no fade with no goddamn Christian Combs, though. <laughs> not with the not with the Fantastic Three. You know what I mean? <laughs> not with the Freak Off Three. Nah, let me stop before they try to catch me, right? Like, yo, you got to fight all, all, all three of us. Mighty Morphin. Now let me stop playing before they get my ass. Oh shit! This this is last night. It's a really important poem for your bum book. Roses are red. Kamala has a laugh. Okay, okay, we don't know about this shit. So this is part of it. Okay. All right, this is old. Is there another real? I had seen one where Ray J was danced on her tight shit, tight shit. And I mean, hold on, let me see. Ray J Amber Rose. Ray J. Amber Rose. Let's see what's cracking with this shit. Nah, I seen Ray J on that booty though. I ain't gonna lie. Oh, where's the video? I can't find it. I seen it on my grand today. For real, for real. Whatever. Maybe it's on Ray J page. Let's go on Ray J page. Let's see if Ray J posted nothing. Oh, yeah, he did. Welcome to the Freak Show. Okay. Bumble Claude. Ray J Mountain, that shit. I see you, my boy. Go ahead, go ahead. I play this shit. Okay. Who the heck is this? All right, okay, all right. I got to see, I got to see, I got to see Christian Combs' um, outfit. King Combs. I got to see what he was wearing. <laughs> What were they wearing at the Halloween party? I got to see it, bro. Does anybody have the picture of Christian Combs at the Halloween party? Let's go to um, Justin Combs. King, uh, is it not King Combs? It's Prince MDC Prince. Right? The Prince MDC? Something like that? Something like this. No. 
Justin Combs Instagram. I don't be knowing, bro. Oh, yeah. Prince JDC. Okay, okay, here we go. I want to see the outfit. No, no, no. This ain't it. Is this it? This ain't it. Oh, he ain't posting a long time. Okay, he ain't been posting. What about Quincy? Quincy, what was you on, brother? I got to see the outfit, man. You know Diddy is the master of the uh, of the Halloween outfits. Uh, nah, they ain't got shit going on. What about the story? Y'all post to the story? Nah, these things ain't posting to the story. Damn, somebody got to... Uh, let me take it off the screen for a second. Let me look at tagged. Somebody tagged him in a picture from last night? Wait, none of y'all got pictures of these guys? Mm, okay. No, let me look at Christian King Combs. Where is that? Where is that? Where is that? No, we can't find it. Can't find it, Chet. No, 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 no. All right, whatever. Hmm. Anyway, did y'all see, um, let's see, Chris Combs. Is it Chris Combs? No. I'm expecting their outfit to be crazy. They love Halloween. Y'all ever seen Diddy Halloween? Remember when Diddy, like, this, this, I remember looking back then, I'm like, Diddy, yo, Diddy, yo, Diddy be wildin'. He not like that. Now I realize Diddy like that. Pussy, 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 yeah. You, nigga. Yeah, him. What's going on? It's Insta Snap TV with fuck? another exclusive. We don't know for sure. Piers Michael was character on. Funny. Diddy. What in the AI is this? I want the full video. Look at this. Hey. 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 <laughs> this outfit is fire. I think this is Christian right here. Is this J Justin? Ooh. Oh. Ooh. Yeah. Oh. Oh, shit. Damn with the hair. Okay, see you boys. Yeah, this nigga look like he flexible. Pause, like he'll beat your ass. This nigga look like he he might hit you with a drop kick on some Ray Mysterio 619 shit, nigga. Imagine getting your ass beat by the Combs brother. Nigga like Harlem shaking, slapping you. This nigga spinning on his head like a fucking gig like Booker T. Then hit you with some Ray Mysterio shit. Another nigga like, you know, you know what's the other nigga named the light skin, light bright nigga? Quincy, he looking at you with the people's eyebrow, hey, you know, slapping you and shit like that. Nah, this might be a problem. Look at this shit. Oh. All right, let, let, let the last brother get some shine, nigga. Oh, shit, here you go. Here you go. Here you go. Okay, okay, I see what's cracking. Yeah, the ass whooping would be epic from these three. I ain't gonna hold you. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I could fuck around and find out. Thinking that these niggas soft. Hell nah, nigga. Nigga, get yo, getting your ass beat by three brothers is like bonding time for them. You know what I mean? Freak offs and ass whippings. <laughs> Freak off. Yo, that yo, one thing you can't say nothing about a Diddy family. They do a lot of family bonding. Freak offs and ass whippings, my nigga. They bond. Yo, let's do this freak off on a yacht and let's beat this one nigga's ass right here. God damn. But yeah, I remember Diddy, Diddy was tweaking out. I remember, uh, let's see if we can find it. The full video, right here. He's pussy, 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 yeah. Well, no, no, you, nigga. Yeah, him. Just like I said. <laughs> yeah. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. You're a clown. <laughs> Don't touch me. What's up, nigga? Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. What's up, baby? We, what's up, baby? What's up? What's up, you don't like me? The motherfucker get to it, nigga. If you don't like me, you motherfucking front. Get to it, bitch. Oh, shit. Don't fucking play with me on Halloween. I'm out here with love, nigga. You want to have love? It's what up, then, nigga. What's up? Bro. Fucking come over here and I'll bust your shit. Nah, hey, keep it pimping. You fucking pussy, bitch, so you don't never talk to me like that, don't nigga. That I'm love, nigga. Here, man. You keep it macking, man. Don't even let him get you out here, man. Keep, keep that, that shit, shit man. What's up, you yeah. shit about that? Then you got a problem? Keep that shit macking, man. He's really taking over my energy. He want to hurt you, man. So what did I do to you? Don't do it for this crowd. Don't do it for this crowd. Don't do it for this crowd. Don't do it for I'm love, but I'll beat your ass. Crowd. Do you know who I am? Bro, for what? Bro, who I am? So love, so love, bro. So love, bro. Yo, 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 bro. So love. It's tough. Come here, give me a hug, though. You lucky, though, nigga. You lucky. You lucky.
I love you. We're trying to stand on it. Say, yo, I, I, I'm about that too. We're together. We're stronger together. <laughs> Did this thing ever talk about that? Yeah, Diddy was going to have his security guards beat your ass, nigga. Did he ever talk about it? Yeah, Diddy was playing this part back. I don't think that you heard me. Interesting. Did that nigga ever talk about it? Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, that nigga probably just. I think that nigga, I don't even know. Is that nigga still alive? I think that nigga probably just disappeared. Michael J. Ferguson. Diddy was going to beat the brakes off of that nigga. Oh, he has a podcast? The crew has it? That's the name of the podcast? Let's see. You never told about Diddy? The crew has a oh, he, oh, he knew not to talk about Diddy. Yeah, Diddy a real nigga, man. Diddy's a real nigga. Fuck that. Okay. All right, man. Yo, Ray J, I'm going to be honest with you, bro. They say Ray J's a blood. I don't know. Ray J, you get your ass beat by... um. By the, the three musketeers, the three sorocketeers, you're done. You're done, okay? Somehow, if you a blood, you got to muster up enough energy to fight all three. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay? This is like some. This is like, this is like one, one of these bad episodes of wrestling. Be like, for that? It's like, you know, Vince McMahon be like, for that? Tonight, hell in the cell with the Undertaker. <laughs> Yo, Ray J, if you lose to these three niggas tonight, you in the cell with Diddy for a freak off. Yep, yep, exactly. <laughs> Let me leave this alone for them three niggas. <laughs> Yo, I can't believe they're doing family jump-ins. <laughs> this is great. The family jump-ins is hilarious. Oh, he got sued for the Batman shit? Did he? Or for the Joker shit? Diddy sued Joker. Diddy, I ain't know. Warner told Diddy stop dressing up as a Joker. So he went Batman this year. Oh, fuck. They banned him from dressing up as Joker? Oh, shit. <laughs> what type of shit is this? I ain't gonna lie, man. I gotta say a shout out to Christian Cones, man. He live in his lyrics, man. He said, yo, yo, what's that line he said? He said, I dare you to say no Diddy. Where'd it go? Uh, um, King Combs' new song. What that song called? Pick a side. He told y'all. Here you go. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Suck my dick. Yeah. Here we go. What? what? Talk about it. Yeah. Yeah. You talking yeah. down the family name? Hold on. Man, you wildin'. Yo, you talking down the family name? You wildin'. You wildin'. Y'all niggas wildin' right now. Y'all niggas wildin' talking down family name. What? Hey. Yo. I dare one of you niggas scream out no diddy. <laughs> Yeah, Dre J fucked up. Let me see what Ray J actually said. Really tapes? No investigation that's going on right now. How many people are in it? Tapes? Are a lot of people being implemented <laughs> into this crazy criminal investigation that's going on right now? How many people are in it? How many celebrities are involved in what they're saying? Or it was important for me to, to, to come online, to do interviews, where it, it it not just shows you that I'm here to help and I'm here to be a voice of reason to try to find a solution for the future young entrepreneurs. It's also saying, listen, Diddy was my friend, not was.
What do you do? What do you do when you've never been in the room? <laughs> what do you do when you've never seen all this shit that people are talking about? Do you believe it? Everybody's innocent until proven guilty. So should I fall back and wait? Should I be a voice of reason now? Should we create roadmaps so new young entrepreneurs don't go through things like this? Because let's ask singer, rapper, and entrepreneur Ray J and founder I, I of the Shade, Shade Room, uh, Angelica Wandu. Thank you both uh, for, for being here. Ray J, I want to start with you. I mean, you heard that that was a, a lawyer for one of the alleged victims here saying that she has seen the tape and the stills and it was a porn. Who do you think it could be, Ray J? Well, I've been around long enough to know that, you know, when there's smoke, you always find fire. <laughs> and I think that, you know, with the market in our world being so cornered and you have this crew of people at the top uh, who make all the decisions, I think, you know, it's like a house of cards. You know, when one falls, you know, the whole deck comes down. And so I think that we'll be seeing a lot of this. I think we'll be seeing a lot of celebrities. We'll be seeing a lot of people in power either step down or be exposed. And oh, nah, this is a clip. This is a clip chat right here. There's a lot of people out here taking from people. Not only, like, like people, are, people are getting robbed of not only their money and their spirituality. <laughs> they're getting robbed of their womanhood and manhood. <laughs> Asses are being taken in ways <laughs> that nobody can explain. Do you <laughs> chuckle? Do you laugh? <laughs> Do you help? Do you criticize? Because I see a lot of jokes out there right now talking about baby oil. Everybody got a joke about having baby oil and lube. Is that okay? Is that the message? <laughs> that was funny, fam. <laughs> Asses are being taken. <laughs> Now, in ways that no manhood, spirituality, they're getting robbed of their womanhood and manhood. Asses are being taken in ways that nobody can explain. Do you chuckle? Do you laugh? Do you help? Do you criticize? Because I see a lot of jokes out there right now talking about baby oil. Everybody got a joke about having baby oil and lube. Is that okay? No. Nah. Is that the message? Mm -mm. <laughs> that was funny, fam. Now what? I don't use baby oil. Lube sometimes in sex makes it better. A lot of people out here taking from people. <laughs> I don't know, man. Y'all niggas better stop playing with the combs, the combs, brother, before y'all niggas get y'all. <laughs> yes, yeah, let me stop. 